Hi, my name's Ken. Welcome along to this top tips for the F2 Beginner English Conversations course lesson number six. Now in this course, I'm going to be showing you how to speak better, how to speak smoother, how to have better pronunciation and to speak clearer. You'll also be learning as you speak, which is quite important as well. So in this lesson, we, we have a couple of topics. The topics for lesson number six are telling the time, part two. We show you how to, when to use minutes when, we're, when we are telling the time. We're going to be showing you how to use two and past the hour as well. And also how to, how to tell someone you're good at something or you're bad at something, your ability at something. So these are the topics for lesson number six. The first part is telling the time. We, we ex I explained to you that five minutes past the hour and 10 minutes past the hour, 20 minutes past and 25 past. When the, when the minute hand is on these minutes, we don't actually say minutes. For example, we would say five past, 10 past, 20 past, 25 past. So the lesson gives you more explanation on how to say this correctly. There's a couple of examples if you want to listen to just now. When the minute is five, 10, 20, or 25, we say five past, 10 past, 20 past, 25 past. When the time is not five or 10 or 20 or 25, we actually do use the word minutes for that. So for example, with this example, it's 8.03, we would say it's three minutes past eight. So I explain this to you as we go through the lesson. Have a listen to this. For example, it's five past nine. It's five past nine. It's five past three. It's five past three. Now, obviously, when we tell the time, most of the time we don't say it's 17 minutes past three. We will give the nearest five minutes. I, I certainly do that. Most English people will do that as well. So we use the word about for this. It's about 20 to five, for example. It's, it's about half past four. So we use about to show not exactly the time, but the nearest five minutes. So have a listen to this. What time is it? What time is it? It's 25 to three. It's 25 to three. So for all other minutes, we just add the word minutes. For example, it's three minutes past eight. The last part of the lesson is talking about good at and bad at, your ability at something. Now the pronunciation for this, good at, we will join it together. For example, we will say, I'm good at playing guitar. I'm good at playing guitar. So we join good and at together when we're speaking, just for smoothness. You can have a listen to this one. It's 29 minutes to five. It's about half past four. And it's very, very similar when we're talking bad at. It's exactly the same, bad at. And we join it together, so it becomes bad at. I'm bad at cooking. I'm bad at cooking. So watch out for these linking sounds together. They really help with your pronunciation and to speak a lot clearer and a lot smoother with your English skills. So I hope you enjoy this lesson six. I hope you like these top tips and I hope you see yourself improve. Remember, if you look at the lesson, please leave me a rating and review. This really, really helps me to keep producing courses and it will help other students as well. So thanks very much for your time and good luck.